Hey you guys, it's me Kiana once again coming at you today. Um, I'm coming at you today with the wig that I got from eBay on. Um, I have that wig on. It's one of two that I ordered. I ordered a long one with China bangs like this as well. Um, but this is the short bob um, and it's in the wrong color. It's in dark brown and you guys know I only do jet black or blonde mixed black. So, um, we just wanted to work with it. Um, as you know, I paid $10 with free shipping from this um, seller from eBay. And it came from Hong Kong. First, let's talk about the packaging. The packaging sucked. I actually got the wig in this, you guys. This is what my wig came in. But again, we have to remember, this wig was $10 with free shipping. Okay? But... I know a lot of you guys just want to know all the details before you purchase items from eBay. A lot of you guys never even purchase wigs from eBay. So I just wanted to let you know the pros and cons so that you, A, don't maybe have to spend the money that I spent. B, just be more mindful of you're going to get the quality of what you paid for. Um, and just be able to see the inside and outside of the wigs. Now, as far as the wig itself, I do believe that these are basically um, just like if we sit down and make a wig, a quick weave to the um, stocking cap or whatever. I do believe somebody actually just sat down. It wasn't a company or nothing. It's just somebody just actually um, knew how to lay the pieces onto the netting. That's all. So, um, this is somewhat of what it looks. I just took it out the package and I just placed it on my head. Um, I simply just wanted something that I can uh, have a bang uh, just for this fall and maybe swoop it behind my ear because I do have um, a huge headband collection and I got the kind of headbands with the feathers on them and everything so I wanted something really simple simplicity um, was the key to, with this um, wig I chose I wanted something really simple that could highlight um, my uh, headband collection so that's why I actually chose a short wig um, in this style. So I'm going to take it off for you guys. Um, I, my, I don't have anything on my face because I'm also, a lot of people have been asking me to do um, a brow tutorial as well as how do I apply my uh, false lashes. I got 30 pair from eBay for a dollar free shipping. I applied mine with nail glue. I mean, I'm not nail glue. Oh my God, hair glue. Uh, so... I'm going to show you guys how to do that um, safely and I'm going to show you how it does not actually take out your lashes because I actually lay it slightly above my lash line. Um, but everybody wanted me to do the eyebrow tutorial. If you look back on some of my videos, I actually did this before, but I'll show you again on how you can actually do your eyebrows in less than a minute. Um, so let's get started with the hair. Okay, this is how it looks with the little swoop behind the ear and it's not bad I mean it's really not it didn't come with no egg uh, head really no cone head I'm sorry but um it's not that bad and a lot of wigs I've, I've heard people complain that a lot of wigs from Hong Kong actually um are small because they're smaller people in general really um but yeah I've heard a lot of people say that their wigs, so the caps are really, really, really tight. Um, this one is perfect, actually. It's um, it has the adjustable strap in the back. Um, it doesn't have any combs though for you guys that have to have that. But it's really, it's it's snug. It's not snug to the point where it's irritating though. So this wig doesn't, it will not go nowhere. But let me take it off for you guys. We're gonna turn the wig inside out. It just has your standard cap and the center is that little closure piece that you use that's why I said it looks like it was hand done and now that I'm looking closely I mean they did a good job for it being hand done but this is how it looks
and again it didn't have a cone head and it just has the adjustable straps in the back it doesn't have a company name on it so that's one inkling of uh, why I said it was just probably handmade and then that's it so we're gonna place it back on my head and this is just like the kind of comb I would use now it does have a few once I comb it out I'll show you it does have a few because they didn't package it well and it came all the way from Hong Kong so you know it's been in everybody's um, post office from here to there but it does have like a few dents in it and I'm going to hope hopefully the camera will pick it up Do you see that dent right there it's a slight bump that's because of how it was folded do you see right there I think that shows right there but that's like a making it look like a permanent wave so what you want to do is um, you can still just like if you had the cone head you can just simply put the wig on the the wig head that you may have this, the styrofoam one put that on and then um and then spray it with um wig spray and hopefully that dent will come out Now it does have a little bit of pieces that I'm going to have to trim myself, but that's with usually with any little bob wig that you may get, because bob wigs you want it to be, people usually get it because because of the preciseness of it. So you want your bob wig to be precise. I have a good amount of shedding. I'll show you guys that. But again, you get what you pay for. Um, I don't plan on having this wig as um, in my collection for months and months and months to come. It just serves its purpose for a season, maybe. This is the shedding. That's just from what I just did. So. We're going to check out, once I get the long one, we'll check out that one as well. See how well that works out. Um, again, just to make sure it's precise, you're going to definitely want to trim little bits and pieces that you may have. And like I said, if you're the type that don't, you, you like wearing sometimes headbands and stuff, this is the kind of wig that you definitely want to go get. Um, you can even get it from your local hair store. I'm not going to pin this. I'm not going to. Um, I'm not going to uh, snap this in, in place right now, just because I want to go ahead and do the video for the makeup. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do the uh, next video is going to be on the makeup because we're already at nine minutes. So this is strictly on the wig review for eBay so again if you're just going after something quick and you're just going at the simple um, and you're also going after you don't want to spend a lot of money and maybe you want to just highlight some little headbands that you maybe found more shutting you guys So this is definitely the type of wig um, you want to get. Pootie over here, he got my wig that I had on yesterday and he combing it. <laughs> anyway, um, hope you guys like this review and hopefully I gave you all the information that's needed. 
Um, as far as the sale, I just need to go to my eBay, and I will give you that information. By the time y'all start commenting, I'll have that information for you guys. Um, so that's about it. Love you guys. Thank you for rating, commenting, and subscribing, as usual. Um, our family is, is extending quite a bit, if you look at uh, my number of subscribers now. Even though it's expanding, I do still want to keep it close-knit, because I think only a certain amount of us are true divas and that's who I really want my audience to be <laughs> but anyway um, I love you guys anybody that subscribes please send me a message um, so that I will know that you did so that way I can go to your page check out and, and also welcome you to the family um, because it's hard for me to keep track of you guys if you don't send me a message I don't go individually through my subscribers so you could be there for weeks and I wouldn't even know um, unless you start sending me messages. If you send messages or comments, I always, if it's a new person, I will recognize you. Um, I will also go to your page and welcome you and sub um, and all that good stuff. So I just wanted to let you guys know, please make sure if you subscribe um, and you're a newbie, leave me a comment, um, maybe a, a, a channel message or whatever um, so that I can actually recognize you. Um, because you will be new to the family at that point. So, thank you guys once again. And I'll be back with the next video for the eyebrows. Um, how I apply my fake lashes with the um, hair glue. It will not take out your lashes really. And, um, and also we're going to do maybe a pink look today. Um, simply because these bangs just remind me of Nicki Minaj. So, <laughs> alright you guys. Be blessed.